let us discuss a question on ray optics which came in J.E. Mains 2016. So here's the question. In an experiment for determination of refractive index of glass of a prism by I delta plot, it was found that a ray incident at an angle 35 degree suffers a deviation of 40 degrees and that it emerges at an angle 79 degrees. In that case, find approximately the maximum possible value of the refractive index. So let us try to solve this problem. First of all, let us draw the situation given in the problem. So it is given that there is a prism. Let us assume that its prism angle is A and a ray is incident at an angle of 35 degrees and then it emerges out at an angle of 79 degrees and during this it suffers a deviation of 40 degrees. So, we can write that the incidence angle I is equal to 35 degrees, the deviation angle delta is equal to 40 degrees and the emergence angle E is equal to 79 degrees. Now, we know that delta is equal to I plus E minus A. So, from here we can calculate the prism angle A is equal to I plus E minus delta and this is equal to 35 degrees plus 79 degrees minus 40 degrees which is equal to 74 degrees. Now from the question we can write that the minimum angle of deviation that is delta minimum will be less than or equal to 40 degrees. So now if we calculate the refractive index of this prism, it can be given by the relation mu equal to sine of A plus delta minimum by 2 by sine of A by 2. Now the maximum value of refractive index will be when delta minimum is maximum. That is mu max will be equal to sine of A plus 40 by 2 by sine of A by 2 because 40 is the maximum value of delta minimum. Now if we substitute the value of A in this relation we will get sine of 74 plus 40 by 2 by sine of 74 by 2 which is equal to sine of 57 degrees by sine of 37 degrees. Now we don't exactly know the value of sine 57 degrees and we know the value of sine 37 degrees that is equal to 0 0.6. To calculate the value of sine 57 degree we know two values that is sine 53 degree and sine 60 degree. So sine 53 degree is equal to 0 0.8 and sine 60 degree is equal to 0 0.866. So now sine 57 degree lies in between these two values. So we will take an average of them. And sine 37 degree as we know is 0 0.6. So if we calculate this, we will approximately get 1.39. So this is the maximum value of the refractive index of the prism.